Hi, I'm Allie. You may remember me as Baba Sheep from Mother Goose Club. But I'm embarking on a new adventure with my friend, Alfie. Join us as we explore the fascinating animal kingdom. Wild, wild, wild. It's Wild Wild Wow! Hi everyone! I'm feeling very happy today. In fact, I couldn't be happier. <laughs> <laughs> it's nice to see you so cheerful, Alfie. What's happened? I've just had my checkup at the dentist, and she said my teeth are raw fine. See? <laughs> That's great! That must mean you're taking really good care of your teeth and brushing them well. I've done exactly that, Allie. Do you want to hear something really cool? Mm -hmm. I know an animal that's found in the wild that doesn't go to the dentist and never worries about its teeth falling out. Really? What animal is that? Let's take a visit to the Creature Scope, and I'll show you. I think you're trying to trick me, Allie. I reckon that this animal you're talking about doesn't have any teeth at all, does it? They have lots of teeth. You're kidding. Take a look and see for yourself. Wow, wow, wooha! A crocodile! That's right, and look closely at its head. I see a huge number of teeth. Crocodiles have between 60 and 110 teeth. Wow! And here's the best thing. Whenever they lose a tooth, a new one grows in its place. Wild! So that's why we don't need to see a dentist. Correct. A crocodile can live for 70 to 100 years, and during its life, it can grow thousands of new teeth. I see them. They sure have a lot. That's because they're meat eaters. They catch wild animals and fish for their food, so they need lots of teeth to grab them. Right. But get this. Because crocodiles can store fat in their long tails, they don't actually eat a lot. In fact, the biggest crocodiles can go without eating for nearly two years. Incredible! Crocodiles are amphibious, which means they can live on land and in water. So you find them around rivers, lakes, and swamps. And the largest ones live around the sea. They're called saltwater crocodiles and can grow to seven meters long. Gosh, there's a lot more to crocodiles than I thought. They're the largest reptile on Earth, and they've been around since the time of the dinosaurs. So they're pretty special creatures. Right. But I don't think I'd like to meet one. They look pretty scary. Well, there is a safe way we can get up close to a crocodile. How? We can make a crocodile. Great idea, Ali. Come on, then. Let's take a trip in the Zippy Zoomer. <laughs> Ready, everybody? Let's wow, wow, wow! Hey there, kids, come gather around. Come meet the animals, adventures abound. Learning, exploring, let's seize the day. Come on, let's play! Yay! Hills to jungles and seas, up in the sky to the trees. Yeah, it's wow, wow, wow! What do we need to make our crocodile, Ali? All we'll need are six cardboard cutouts. We've painted these green. We have paper that we cut into a crocodile head and crocodile teeth. Some eyes. Split pins. Glue. A pencil and a pencil sharpener. Ready to begin? Let's do it! It's time to decorate. You're going to decorate the body. Mm. And I'm going to decorate the crocodile head. Okay, Alfie, do you think you can glue on these crocodile teeth? Sure. And then after that, you can add the crocodile's eyes. Ooh. Here you go. Thank you. I'm going to take a pencil, put these two pieces together. Now I'm going to poke my pencil through the middle. So it's easy to put my split pin through.
How's it going over there? All done. <laughs> oh, no. I think you drew your design on this side. Oh, no. No worries, Alfie. I'll just draw it again. Oh, great idea, Allie. Now it's time to glue our crocodile head onto his body. <gasps> There we have it, our very own snapping crocodile. Snap, snap, Ooh. snap. <laughs> it looks great, Allie. It sure looks friendlier than a real croc. And you can make your very own snapping crocodile, too. Mm -hmm. Give it a go. It's lots of fun. <laughs> Jumping down on grass I like the hippo in a cool mud bath Are you ready like a hippo? Can you say Ah, ah, ah Open your mouth Open wide Ah, ah, ah Let's hear you loud and clear Can you say Ah, ah, ah Open your mouth Open wide It's time to get those brains into gear again. Can you guess which animal I am? I've got a long nose that reaches all the way to the ground, which I use to pick things up and put in my mouth to chew. <laughs> and I walk very slowly, swing my nose from side to side. And I've got big ears that droop beside my face. Have you guessed which animal I am? If you guessed an elephant, then you guessed right. Mm. It's time for us to say goodbye for today. We hope you've had as much fun as we've had. And don't forget, we always say, it's wild, wild, wild. wild. It's, it's wild, wild, wild. wild.